Hey, man. Y'all really want to breed dogs for a living, man? You want to be in the backyard, shit hunting? That's what y'all really want to do? That's what you really want to do with your life, man? Shit hunt? I can't believe how somebody would really want to breed dogs for a living. All right. What, you, do you even know the first steps, man? You even know what to do? Man, if y'all into stuff like that, man, stick around, man. We're going to... Go over five things, man. Five things. And I want y'all to listen, man. Y'all messing up, man. If you don't want to do this stuff, just don't do it, man. You don't like shit, hunting, Don't do it. Yeah. Talking to my mirror like I love you so much. Curving on my critics like I heard you so what? You can't kill my confidence. I think I'm the man. Tally all the fucks I ever gave on my head Lately I've been living like I can't take a loss They ain't wanna help me, that's what made me a boss You can't kill my confidence, I think I'm the man We don't give a fuck, that's what they don't understand I'm back again like flu season I broke records while loose leaf And I'm coming now on my roof leaving Don't give a fuck, I don't care uh, Did the shit by my lonesome No wonder now I'm on one No shortcuts on that long run Show mo, show bo, robo, wave ride. Cool shawty, too naughty, pool party, wet for the face ride. Any up, penny down, hand me down, thrift store, old drip. New money, too funny, oh shorty, talk about oh shit. I'm on their ass now, can't get a pass now. I'm a cash cow, keeping it brash now. Niggas is trash now, I'm a spaz out. I've been killing my lows and living on highs. You see in the skies the proof. You could just see in my eyes that there is no lies. I cannot disguise the truth. I've been duck dog, getting sucked off in my new merch, color. Duck sauce on the new couch with my chucks on Get the fuck on with that hate I'm big cool on the small chat Cause I know now that I'm all that Got a hot guy on the ball cat Get the fuck out of my face uh. Talking to my mirror like I love you so much Curving on my critics like I heard you so what You can't kill my confidence I think I'm the man Tally all the fucks I ever gave on my head Lately I've been Alright man, y'all ready? I mean, piece of paper, man. But well, y'all understand, man. Y'all gotta pay attention. I mean, the first thing, man, get you a good product, man. If you don't know how to build a dog with structure and color, everything people like, man, you gotta start there first, man. Figure out if you got a good product or not, man. What you gonna breed, man? You like bullies, man? Stick with them damn bullies. I love bullies. What type of bully I like? A big old fat one. Big old fat MF. You know. Big old shoulders. Big old fat belly, man. I like that. You gotta figure out what you like. Build the product and sell it. Find out who like it. Find you a niche, man. Find you a good product. Find a big old head. Big old head piece. No, people you gotta find out what people like, man. You know, joint interest. Find out what people like, what you like, combine it together, and now you got a good product. Something that you'll believe in, man. That's what you wanna do. Find your product, niche market, good product first, man. See, pay attention, man. First thing, good product, man. Hopefully y'all listening, man. All right, man, number two, man. Let me get, refer back to my notes, man. Social media platforms, man. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch. All that stuff the little youngest is on, man. You want to get on all that and overload them. Full of your product, man. Your bully. Your dog, man. Your dogs. Don't matter if you just got one. I've seen people build a whole empire with just one dog. Make them look like a big kennel. But you want to be on all them social media platforms, man. Every single one. Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. You want to get on all of them, man. And flood it. Flood it out, man. I don't care if they see a picture 300 times of the same dog. Who gives a shit, man? People got to see your product. So number two, man, social media, man. Promote shun, man. Promote your dog, man. Promote your kennel, man. 
Don't care about how many times it's being showed at all. Keep listening, man. All right, man, we on number three, man. I want y'all to listen to me carefully, man. Real carefully. This is number three, and it is content. What the people see. And this is for you characters that want to walk out back and flip open your old, your old flip phone and take a picture and think you just made it. This is for you characters, man. You just can't walk out back and pull out your old Polaroid picture, camera picture thing taker, and think you about to get a good picture and you just gonna get a million people following you when they want your dog. You gotta invest in some camera equipment, man. You gotta get you a couple lenses, man. Get you a DSLR, you gotta get you a mirrorless joint, one of them, one of them damn, you know, cameras, man. You gotta spend some money, man. It's about content, man. People will not stay on your content long if it is terrible. Throw away the damn flip phone, man. Guys ain't in the trap no more, man. Put that stuff up, man. Get you, get you some, get you, get you some money in your pocket and go invest in your business, man. You can't make no money without spending some money. I mean, who, who taught you guys, man? We, guys ain't go to school or nothing like, nothing like that, man. You need to go to school, man. Let's just move on, man, because you guys get good content, man. Make some people laugh or something, man. Get out, get. Take some good pictures, some good pictures, man, with the, the bulkhead in the background. Get it all blurry back there. That way, you, that, way that, that dog just sticking out like, hmm, you know, right in your face. You know what I'm saying? Get it all maxed out like that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what I'm saying? Like that, man. You don't know how to do it like that, man. Maybe you ought to plant you some roses or something. Maybe sell some flowers. This thing on, man. Y'all see me? All right. Listen, we on number four. This is more like a, a don't. This is number four, but it's a don't. You don't do this. You don't go into partnerships when you first begin your damn kennel, man. You do it on your own. It's a family business, man. Get the kids to work. The old lady out there. She fill up some water buckets. You don't want to make it messy, man. Get on your own feet. Figure out your own thing. Invest your own money. Figure it out yourself, man. Ain't no one-two punch in the beginning. Don't make it messy, man. Ruin relationships and friendships for no apparent reason, man. Do it on your own. On your own time. Start off with one dog. Don't overload yourself. Start off with, start off with a couple hundred dollars. Rather than a couple thousand. Build it up. Make a name for yourself. No partnerships. None. No pup back deals, no none of that. Do it on your own, man. Don't put this thing on, man. Let's refocus. Yeah. You see me? Hey, y'all make sure you're listening, man. No partnerships, man. Buy your own damn dog and pay your own stud fee. Figure it out yourself. Yeah, I'm almost done talking to y'all, man. So I'm getting excited. But listen, man, y'all done got enough of my time today, and I'm so happy to be at number five, man. And I see too many of y'all doing this wrong. Number five is just so important, man. I don't get where, I'm pretty sure y'all done had a job before, but I don't know where you guys get off not understanding number five is the most important thing with being a successful kennel, man. It is it is the most important thing with being successful with anything when you're dealing with the public. Why do y'all want to sell dogs with the lack of customer service, man? The lack of knowledge and understanding that the customer is the number one priority, man. I don't care if you call my phone a thousand times, man. Well, I do care. I do care. Let's take that back. I don't care if you put money in my pocket for a deposit for one of my dogs and you want to call me about that dog, I will not huff and puff, man. I don't see where these guys get off at taking people's money and not understanding that there will be some customer service that is attached to that, man. I'm gonna answer that phone with a smile on my face within business hours. So this is the thing. You guys need to understand customer service. But you guys, you guys obviously have to protect yourself as well. So if that's the case, Create some business hours. Put something on your voicemail. Let your customers know. Like, you know what? 
Between 9 and 5, I am more than welcome to take it. calls, answering emails, and just being overall available to my customers. But customer service, man? You call from one of my studs? I'm going to answer the phone. Even if you just want to know how much he is. How much is the stud fee, sir? $3,000. No problem. You just hunting for some information. Thanks for calling. Appreciate you. I appreciate your potential business. Well, that's business, man. We're on to see where you guys get off. But listen, that wraps up my whole YouTube splurge. I don't, I don't know if y'all made it this far, but I don't really even care. And most people know, know nothing about breeding dogs. Like I say all the time, man. I don't know what y'all doing on y'all's yard, but this is what we doing on ours. Peace.